What is going on everybody? Welcome again to Brailsford's Rides for another exciting video. This is something a little bit different. It's definitely cool different. Man. Definitely different for our channel. Uh, we picked up a 2023 Coleman Lantern LT 17B. Uh, it's a 17 foot camper. Um, me and the wife have been talking about getting a camper for about two or three years now and we kept delaying and delaying and finally got to the point where finally got to the point where we're talking about the kids are just too old getting so old that we don't want to miss out on any more opportunities uh, for enjoyment so we went ahead and pulled the trigger on this one and we'll show it to you it looks small but you know what it's perfect for us this is our first camper and it was the most reasonably priced camper on the market and let's walk through it so as you can see no real frills here on this camper. We have a power awning on the outside. And we got TV. We have a water heater located right here. Uh, stabilizing jacks are only on the rear, so I'm probably gonna install some up front to have four stabilizers on this thing. What stabilizers? You do have an outside outlet here. So I love this. You got compartmental storage. Uh, only access from one side, but it goes all the way to the other side. Nope. Uh, you have one propane tank, a battery, and it does come outfitted uh, with wiring for a solar panel so you can trickle charge the battery if you want to go off grid, but I haven't hooked it up yet. I don't have a panel yet, so we're just going to let it sit. Come over here. You have your city water connection, your water tank. I believe it's a 40 gallon tank. The AC unit is a side mount, and on top of the TV, or on top, you also know there's a digital antenna. So very basic your cord for your uh, camp powers right here and the cord comes with it then you got your your gray water tank right here and your black tank right there come on Hayden let's go inside the camper let's take you guys inside real quick So, Dude, this is the inside. It is the inside. We're coming inside. Where our baby's gonna Let's turn the light on. Oh, yeah. It's a very oh. basic. Here you go. You want to get up there? There's a light up here. Oh, look. It's so different. A very basic awesome. queen bed up front. What? All right. You do have a mount right, or a stud right here What's where you can install a TV, and there's an antenna on top. And there's, so, there's a switch yeah. where you can go from uh, antenna yeah. to cable if you run cable on the outside. You have a shelf. Hi. There's the AC unit. So you do have some storage right here. And it goes both ways on either sides. So a popular mod is to knock out this panel and put a, a knob here and turn it into a slide door. So that way you can get better access to all that. Uh, the kitchen, excuse the mess. I'm working on some upgrades. Here's the TV stand. Uh, basic sink. Basic sink. It's got some, some water pressure still. Uh, gas range there's no automatic igniter so you do need matches to light this uh, for heating you do have this electric fireplace down here and i think you do need to be plugged into shore power to run this what's solar power because it's electric heat so it uses a lot of power uh, this is a 30 amp camper you have overhead storage on the sink now one thing that would be nice would be some struts so i'm probably going to do i'm probably going to do the strut upgrade and we'll put the strut up struts on here to hold it up on both of these comes with a microwave and a mini fridge and what i kind of like this is an electric straight up electric mini fridge like one you could buy at a store which i actually really like because we're not going to probably run it on propane um so that way if like the one of the mini fridges or my ac unit goes out i can just replace it myself no big deal hayden what do you think we got the bunks, we got the uh, two bunks for the boys, and then the tape, the Where's kitchen table, the which is folded up over there, lays here, and it can become its own bed. I, I got the... No, 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 no. Yeah. Come here. So, so this is kitchen bed. table, you lay it here, and it can become its own bed. You'll put the side uh, pads on, and it becomes another sleeper spot. Walking in, let's hit that light. Here's the bathroom, very basic. You have a toilet, Whoop. 
Sorry, Hayden. And you have a shower. But I see that there. I didn't know there was a light in here. Excuse me. So I'm gonna be, I'm uh, being six foot tall. <laughs> My head's gonna be in that, so I would have to crouch down. We'll probably install some uh, storage compartments that are skinny along the wall here. Yeah. We're definitely gonna be looking for different ways to upgrade this thing and create more storage and just make it more livable and enjoyable for us. You have a nice little storage slot here for various things, pens, pencils, screwdrivers, whatever. You got some two drawers here. Uh, underneath here, or actually over, so this is wasted space. You can turn, a lot of people turn this into storage and the bypass for the water heater is under there. One nice thing, you do have a smoke detector up here and you have a carbon monoxide detector down there. Let's go ahead and turn the lights off so I'm not wasting the battery. The boys are big fans. I'm really excited. The wife's excited. We've already booked our first trip here in a few weeks and we're going to take this thing out, take it for a test run. Um, I know this isn't my normal Mustang content, but this is a good opportunity uh, to, you know, kind of branch into something else. There won't be too many camper videos, but I will be doing some modifications and stuff to this thing. For my Mustang followers, please bear with us. We are using this as a opportunity to generate some new channel revenue for the Paxton fund for the Boss 302. So since we are one of the first with the 2023 Lantern, we definitely want to get this video out there and you can stand by for some more things. We'll do setup videos, we'll do some other videos. Uh, if you're a Mustang guy, don't worry about it. You don't, I don't, I'm not gonna be offended if you don't watch it, but for you guys who do try and true, do appreciate it. For the price uh, and for what you get, I definitely think the Lantern is a great deal. Uh, I'd recommend it to a small family. Um, we're not even a small family, but it can sleep up to five comfortably. I grew up camping in a camp, a pop-up camper, and that was with five people and two Rottweilers. So we got two or two large dogs. We're bringing him. Peter. Where are you going? Where are you going, Hayden? Where are you going? But we've got two large dogs and a large family of five, and we're gonna make this thing work. And uh, yeah, stand by for more, guys. If you'd like to see more camper content, please comment down below. Let me know if you have a camper, let me know. Uh, and if you're interested in a uh, Coleman Lantern 17 Bravo, let me know. That's gonna do it for today's video. Everybody stay blessed, stay safe. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe. See you later.